Jack Flash in the building, everybody in the building, yeah. Noble, yeah. Uh, Travel Gang, uh, shout out DJ Lucky for having us. Yeah. 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 Seven. I, 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 I ain't even got all my shout outs together, but enough about us. Let's go ahead and get it into the people that are about to rap battle each other. On my left, from Boulder, Colorado, we got one line. We got Solid Theory. Hey! Hey! What's good, y'all? Solid Theory, BSG, MPB. Let's get it in, man. About to hire right. my best friend. Hey! Uh, man, I'm gonna let Solid in there. Yeah, that shit was way down there. We ain't getting that shit done. Yeah, that shit was way down there. All right, here we go. And we'll let Solid in there. Who goes first? It's all here. Yeah, nineties, three nineties, nineties, nineties loose. All right, so three nineties, round one, part one, solid theory. Let go, yo, yo. I'm up here battling my best friend. Man, I love this shit. BSG forever, right? That's the fucking click. See, we're about to put on a show for y'all. So go ahead, get crunk to this. Oh wait, that's right, we're battling. Well, you can go suck a dick. I mean, I'm surprised you even made it here. I'm sure the cops want to catch you. Ever since you dissed us and started hanging with a different squad, this bad news, you went to jail and came back. Now there's a lot you can't do, cause you're on probation. NWAs like the Compton Rap Crew. See, there's bars, right? Rebuttals, that's right. Rebuttals, performance, finishers. I got all them bitches locked down like a Mormon minister, but the other right? Neo said that our form is similar. Well, you just got a fake cosign like you forged a signature. You've been there for most of my battles, but now you might be sorta of insecure. Because this one eye will close down faster than Forrest Whitaker. I'm running game. I'm running game. Like Shaq O'Neal in track and field and flawless. You need to quit this battle shit. Undergo a massive healing process. I mean, one time you said you're on top and you rap so ill you're nauseous. That's the biggest lie I heard since your bitch said I'm on the morning after pill, I promise. 
still getting arrested. Your whole life you've had to deal with losses. You're looking like a grown ass kid. That's Andy Milanakis. Your sister was right. Your sister was right. This is a mismatch. Something has gone wrong. The shit is like Chuck Liddell versus your grandmom's mom. The shit is like Tinder versus Mash.com. Fubu versus Rockaware. Fucking Echo versus Sean John. I'm like Strong Arm Steady when it had Exhibit Phil and Cron Dawn, right? Bitch, you like Cisco when he did the thong song. I mean, it just seems like rap is some shit you never knew before. You're off beat like white people trying to clap on the two and four. <laughs> Disaster. People call you a human storm. Your mom was pro-life, but turned pro-choice after you were born. I mean, a while ago I realized we weren't representing the same. So I turned to a one-man band like Edwin McCain. He raps like he's having a tantrum. Me and him never could hang, traveling past him. I'm like the national anthem. That's ahead of the game, so fuck him. No, I'm joking. <laughs> I mean, it's still BSG, right? We both put in blood, tears, and sweat for the gang. And even though we've been through this shit, it's not like our friendship has changed. So you can hate us and put that on whatever you claim. Just know I'm Birdman in the studio. Man, put some fucking respect on the name. Let's go. 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 Let
you'll forever be a no name, I'm sure of it. It's cause you smell. That's something that won't change, it's permanent. You can't get girls in your ride. No matter how much cocaine you're working with, you're a stone cold lady killer. No David Berkowitz, but still you act like you pull females, and your whole game is murderous, even though you turn them off on accident, like your phone's location services. I mean, I'm supposed to think you date girls. I'm supposed to think you date girls your age. No, the fuck you not. Most weeks you're in a kissing booth. Post it up the block. I guess third graders think your flows are something hot because you do have the same swagger that the Jonas Brothers got. You said my girl does this and that. I wish I could rebuttal that bullshit, but I'm lost. Your girlfriend ain't said shit about you. Cause she ain't old enough to talk. I mean, <laughs> you tell people at basketball, you're more fire than a dragon fight. You can dunk from outer space, jumping over a satellite. But we don't believe that shit neither. And no one thinks her handle's nice. Might have something to do with how fucking gay you dance at night, so quit pretending. So quit pretending. Your basketball skills got you them bragging rights. You're not like Mike or like Magic. You more like Magic, Magic Mike. Mike. <laughs> See, Jordan's the kind of dude, if you're having a party, Jordan's the kind of dude to show up smelling like used condoms, and sweat, throw a one-man late rager, leave your mom and dad's wreck, wake up the next morning in the middle of an awful-ass mess, looking like you just survived the first Honda crash test. Once your mom gets there, he'll approach her, drinking a 40 bottle, half dress like what's up want to have sex <laughs> so, time, time. time make some noise yeah. here we go round two part two let's keep it going go ahead rock one life all right so a tisket a tasket you're willing to wake a basket this dude breaks into his dad's house for the pills in his liquor cabinet. I never, I never chill with a big, I never chill with a sick addict. You had to take kickboxing classes, cause that's the only way that you can kick the habit. And I never seen so much skill in a bigger faggot. This shit talk can end. I bet you're real good at tickle matches. I bet you live lock with men with all your kickboxing friends. Your sexuality's confused, like how you've been doing the crip walk with Trip walking, flip flops, bumping Kid Rock again. I bet you have dreams of getting double teamed by Nick Offerman and Chris Christopherson. But that's okay, let it out. Don't keep that shit bottled in. Throat sore from all that dick swallowing. You lip talking with the lisp like you got injected with lip collagen. Now, I know you saw the theory, but this ain't no theory, it's fact. If you weren't getting respect from your peers for rap, you should be, you would just be just some dude who's short, bald, weird, and fat. Cause they say that you can freestyle, but if you got magic off the top, it's only cause your hairline's been doing a disappearing act, and you've got a face that can make a mirror crack. Seven years, bad luck. Seven years for that, and you're known to bite styles. You stole Detour's whole career, give it back. Now you ain't packing the Mac in the back of the act. You've been rapping for scraps in a sack of some crack. You act like you're black, but a matter of fact, you get jacked in the you get jacked in the crack, smacked up and clapped. Uh. Now, this is a prize fight. Man, this is the limelight. I'm not about to lose to a dude who got hopped up on malt liquor, installed Tinder, saw a sister, and swiped right. <laughs> Right after this is on Noble. All right, we got you, Travel Gang, y'all. Yo, you drink a lot. Time. No, you drink a lot, but still you get smashed easy like plate glass. It's strange. Now you ain't got shit like Dame Dash. You can't leave the house without getting wasted and straight trash. So you spent more time with the detox than Dr. Dre has. I mean, you're showing signs of being on the rock, like Jay Hope. You can't afford cigarettes. Yet somehow you're a chain smoker. <laughs> People call you a lot of things, but one of them ain't sober. You're such a fucking alcoholic, you use liquor to chase soda. See, one time, he and a, one time he and a girl went to a bar to get drunk for the night. He sat down, ordered 12 beers inside a bucket of ice, eight shots of tequila, four glasses of rum, and a Sprite. Then he turned to the girl like, so, what would you like? <laughs> See, people call you a nuisance. No one wants you in their house. They say you don't do shit but sleep, drink, and vomit on the couch, but you do exercise. I don't know what all that nonsense is about. I always see you lifting whiskey bottles to your mouth. I mean, at one point, Jordan was the best in the squad. That shit was settled. He used to be great, but now he does not have the potential because Jordan lost his head like fighting the Boko Haram African rebels. And I don't mean gifted when I say in all battles he's special because he's retarded now. The bottles of alcohol damaged his mental and gave Jordan downs like the Los Angeles ghetto. He's up at 10 a.m. getting wasted so he can release pressure. 
till he's failing to respond. Like New Orleans relief efforts, wakes up again at 8 p.m., drinks till he pukes on a cheap sweater, cause popping bottles makes his clown sleep better like Heath Ledger. You dream your tax return? Time! Okay. My bad, no man. We, they gonna cut I can't do my man. last, my last. Uh, they gonna cut it short. Hey, y'all wanna hear some more of this shit, man? Yeah! yeah. yeah. You treat your tax return like it's a fucking benefit plan. Sleeping in the park all morning like you're catching a tan. With all the time you spent drunk on a bench or in vans, you think you'd be hitting rock bottom like a wrestling slam. There ain't a bar in the state that isn't getting you banned. Go places and get arrested for having sex with your hand. I mean, it seems like your two feet are a place you never could stand. The other night you fell on your face and needed a medical scan, but I'm sure you're working your ass off doing whatever you can. Because all these rehab centers cost like several grand. You, know, you said to talk about alcohol, it'd have to be stupid. Well, guess what? I am. I'm sure you knew all the shit before I said it. You're always 12 steps ahead of me, fam. Let's go. Time. Tune in straight into Travel Gang. Thank y'all for rocking with us. Sorry, guys. They rushing us, but uh, we're gonna let him rock. Go ahead, one life. <laughs> Round three, part two, let go. So the bigger they, they say the bigger you are, the harder you fall. So y'all about to feel the impact of Arthur Jamal. In fact, in that gorilla chest beats a heart that's so small, you walk and talk like you're gangster, but you never even been a part of a brawl. And I know for a fact. That you only started to rap when you saw eight when you saw eight mile. True story. That's what started it all. See, that's why you just oppose the lane. You want to be like Quasimodo, the rapper, but you're more like the hunchback of Notre Dame. That's so you don't have stories of how much you overcame or went through so much pain that you could go insane. You never rolled cocaine or rolled with gangs. Your biggest hardships involve losing at bowling games, the adventures of Lois Lane and Percocets and Novocaine. Because it's the only way that you could cope with fame. Because you've been gassed up so much that I've never let you near an open flame. Number one in the state? Please, I'm just letting you hold my chain. And your team is called Male Pattern Baldness. A bunch of no names that I could kill with a bottle of Rogaine. That's right. Fuck MPB, y'all are useless. You guys are the battle rap, what MTV is the music. Because when it comes to skill at battling, y'all are like the Hiltons, Kardashians. No real talent, but you gained your name, you claim to fame by getting fucked by some rappers in front of a camera lens. And I could have sworn I've seen you outside of Castleman's. Giving handies for ambience, candy and brandy. <laughs> Outside of Castleman's, giving handies to man mannequins, candy and ah, handies to mannequins, brand brandy and ambience. <laughs> you went to the fist fight, throwing hands against a man who's made of adamantium. Time, time, and make some noise, boss. Hey, y'all go ahead and make some noise for that battle. It'll take a lot to come up here and diss your best friend. In front of all of y'all motherfuckers, you know what I'm saying? Hey, so if you're everybody from the window to the wall, from the freeway to the DJ, to make some noise for body bag battles real quick. All right, y'all, we all over Facebook. Check us out. But enough about us. Let's go ahead and push it into my man, Noble. I think they're ready to go. I apologize. I am B.O. The Face. Check us out on Facebook, Twitter. Body bag battles. We got another cipher coming up later, but uh, none of that is important right now because we got a hot ass act that's about to hit the stage.